through your emotions as you watch this one tonight? I just had a lot of fun. I mean, uh, I just think it was really easy for me because I, I pretty much know 70% of the team, and I think they know how I'm going to react to them, and, and uh, it was good. I, I just enjoyed it. Uh, the boys, it was all about them tonight anyway, though. It's just, you know, enjoy the moment, play hard, just compete for each other. That's all we were looking for, and uh, we got the response we wanted, and uh, then we just uh, keep attacking the net, have fun on offense, control the puck, be a little bit, you know, poise, uh, poise in our cycles equals, you know, puck possession, and I think they did a good job. And just uh, and going with four lines, uh, you know, I want to make sure uh, moving forward that uh, you know we want to be a four-line team. And uh, I think uh, you know when we piggyback a couple of matchups, uh, the boys did a great job on that. Did their changes, and uh, overall just a solid game for 60 minutes from all, all 20. How important was it for you guys to get rewarded in that first period the way you had played? Yeah, you know, uh, like the the power play goal where they they tipped it and went over Dubes. Uh, you know, I said, hey, now we're going to have to get one like that, and we happen to get it. And I said, you deserve it. You know, some sometimes, some nights, you know, you don't get the breaks, and you're working. And, you know, we did a good job, and uh, you know, we want to do probably a better net front presence on the power play still, meaning we don't want the guy to see the shot. Uh, it's great to tip it, but we got to get in front of this goalie, and uh, and we'll build from that. But we got a good goal, but we had a couple other good looks too, I think, and we had our numbers inside of their numbers, which I really like going forward, and uh, just keep building on it and uh, and building that confidence, and uh, we had. Some some good scene plays. Miko made a really nice play to uh, Dums there, and uh, I was hoping he one timer it because you know beating goals in this league, you're not going to be able to catch it and shoot it. But uh, and we also had the back door. But uh, those are the plays. If you execute it one out of five, you're 20 percent. You keep improving and building your confidence in the power play. What are you uh, saying all these guys when you're in their ear all game? Uh, just. Just little stuff, you know, details. Uh, you know, if it, you're, you're losing a, a race, uh, you know, let's work to the puck area a little bit better. And, you know, just we just want to tighten up certain areas and just keep building uh, what I feel will help us improve moving forward. And just and hopefully they have trust in me when I ask them to do something differently or make a better decision. I mean, it's not always the correct way, but we want to make sure they know the outs are there or, you know, just a little play where the, the player should talk to the other player. We're, we're losing puck possessions that we should be holding on to so we have to talk a little bit more on the ice especially off a line change and if your your partner's in trouble just work and, and get open and then you'll keep your offense going better you mentioned the word fun a couple times in your first answer is that something you needed it's to fun i mean i've always had fun i mean i mean i might not look it on the bench but i'm having fun i mean i i think you know for players uh, working hard together, and, and, and it's you against them. So it's your team executing your team philosophy against the opponent. So let's, you know, let's have fun doing what we do best, and we've got to do it collectively, though. That's why we've got to all be on the same page and make sure we're on the same game plan. I know it's only two days, but it has changed in the last like 24 hours. Uh, you know what? We're, we're just gonna, you know, we're happy about the win. We, you know, we want them in a good mood. And uh, you know, you, when you when you when you take over jobs, uh, you know, there's a reason why you're here. And you just got to make sure, try to build confidence in the team, and and you know, pat them on the back here and there, let them know, but also let them know if there's a different play that's an option. You know, I've been there. You know, uh, you know, I'm not gonna ride you. You know, we're not winning. I'm not gonna tell you and be all over your head. But I think that I can still do a good job uh, holding you accountable, but also giving you better options. Like the, way the new looks of the lines worked for you uh, tonight? You know, I, I think everybody was going to come out and play a hard game. So I, I did. I, I, li I liked uh, how they worked. I liked how their puck possession time, which was good. But, uh, you know, we got away from our game plan in the second period with the penalties, and it took away our flow and continuity during the game. But I think moving forward, uh, you know, we. I know with this team the whole time has been great on penalty kills, meaning the number of kills, but we can't like, you know, Boston was six, which is an odd, and they did a great job and had a great job in the kill there, but they were the first power play. But we can't be given looks with five penalty kills or four, I don't know what the number was tonight, but five's a lot. You know, you're playing with danger there, and, uh, you know, they're a pretty talented group. The Sedins are, you know, they, they make great plays. So you just got to make sure that you only maybe give them one or two chances in the offensive zone on power plays. Do you always uh, hit the smelling salts on the bench? Yeah. Is that different? Yeah, no, no. <laughs> so, to get me going, I've just, I've just always done it. Uh, I mean, I don't know, but.
I just always sound as a player and as a coach. So I, that's my only superstition, so i got to keep it. Any message to the guys after the game about maybe sustaining this here the next couple of games? Well, enjoy the moment first. You know, they haven't had a good time, and uh, you know, and, and, and enjoy your, your buddy for working hard tonight for you. And, uh, and then, you know, we'll build from it tomorrow and then build into the next game. And, uh, you know, they'll, they'll want to be hungry to come out and prove, prove themselves again. But uh, we just want them feeling good about themselves, and then we'll make our corrections and, and then our adjustments and then keep on improving and getting better.